Writing strategies for low vision, non-optical assistive devices. Low vision is defined as a person who has vision less than 2070 and equal to or better than 2200 in the better eye with best correction. Visual Equity 2070 indicates that a person standing at 20 feet is able to identify a letter which a person with normal vision is able to identify at 70 feet. Most of the person with low vision, for example, elderly with macular degeneration, were able to read and write when they had vision. They were able to see the words clearly. But with the assisting eye conditions, they could not perform reading and writing tasks as good as before. This is because the words that appeared to them had become blurred, loss of contrast, or presence of blind spot. Due to all these conditions, they feel fatigued when they perform near task work. There are some non-optical assistive devices that are available commercially to help a person with low vision to write. These non-optical assistive devices are bowl line papers, felt tip pen, writing guide, and a reading stand. Bowl line paper. Bowl line papers are paper with lines that are darker, denser, and wider than those regular line paper. It provides a larger writing space. The heavy lines between the writing space creates a good contrast for low vision. Felt tip pen By using a felt tip pen, we provide a more distinct image to see. It makes the written words more contrast to the writing space. The 2020 pen is made specifically for users with low vision. There are also other brands of felt tip pen such as Sharpie, Bix, or Pilot. Use the type of pen that fits you the most. How to make our own bowl line paper. First, we measure the space between the line. Okay. Then we sketch it on a piece of blank paper. Okay. Then we use a thick point marker pen and draw the straight line on this blank paper. Okay, just like this. So our own customized bowl line paper was done. Writing tips for low vision. It would be good for a person with low vision perform writing activity on a dark desk table. It helps them not to write out of page. If the right hand is for writing, use the left forefinger as a placeholder. The free forefinger is put on the most left side of the line. Then start writing and remember not to move the left forefinger away from the margin. Before moving to the next writing line, make sure there is sufficient space for the last word of the line. Bring the forefinger to the pen and then check out the space left for the last word. After finished writing on the first line, you trace the writing line by using the left forefinger. The forefinger is placed at the left margin again as a placeholder. Put a paper clip on the current writing line to keep track on how far the page had been written. Slide the paper clip down the page after finished writing on each line. Writing guide is one of the non-optical assistive devices. It provides better contrast and also provides tactile boundaries for the writing line. 
People with low vision could write and fill the space in between. How to write by using a writing guide. The procedure is same as the writing tips for low vision. First, the writing guide is put on a piece of blank paper. Before start writing, make sure the free forefinger is on the most left side of the line as a guide. When finished writing on the line, check whether there is sufficient space for the last word. Retraces the free forefinger on the writing line. Drops it down to the next line. Continue writing on the next line. How to make your own writing guide? First, you have to determine the size of the writing space. The measures is sketched on a piece of card. Use a pen knife to cut the rectangle out. After that, take out a piece of black paper and then stick it to the card. For the last step, cut out the excess paper that is not needed.